Cheers. Mm, this is a way to a great tasting cup of coffee. <laughs> uh, yep. All right, so here's my for our little coffee chat. I know I am. I'll try to keep it a little bit shorter than yesterday. Yesterday was just a chit chatty kind of day. You know, there was a lot going on. Um, uh, yeah, I've been watching Mandalorian, and I absolutely love that show. And um, I'm glad I'm finally finding time because that's my my. Because there's so many shows I want to watch, but it's finding time. You know, so I kind of have to decide. Okay, which one I'm going to watch next, and then like you know watch a couple episodes, you know, or as many as I can a day, right? So, and I'm just so glad I, I get to make a time. I'm sitting down, like, in the morning, I have my coffee or my breakfast. I'm watching a couple episodes, um, uh, folding laundry while watching an episode, you know? So, um, and I absolutely love it. Um, I knew I would, I knew I would, you know, I mean, it's Star Wars, it's George Lucas, so you know it's going to be good. And Baby Yoda, I didn't realize how cute he was until I actually saw him in the show. He is so stinking cute. Um, he has to be the cutest thing on this earth, really. Besides myself, that is. <laughs> doot, doot. Yeah. Uh, but he is so stinking adorable. And we love Baby Yoda. I mean, Henry has too many, too many Baby Yoda plush that, um, I can count. You know, I think he has quite a few. He has too many. I don't know how many. That's how many he has. Um, and he has like two... Baby Yoda pillows and a Baby Yoda hooded blanket he got for Christmas that he goes to bed with every night. So he loves Baby Yoda. He loves anything Star Wars, okay? And I love that because, you know, we can share our love for Star Wars together and get excited over stuff like this, you know, like shows. And, and when he's old enough to watch the movies, because I don't really think he's, he's not old enough to watch. Oh, sorry. I just knocked you. <laughs> he's not old enough to watch the movies, yeah. So, um, <laughs> the show, um... I don't know, you know, I think there are some parts he could watch, but there would be some parts I can skip. So um, that's that's kind of still a jury, you know, because he does want to watch it because he knows I'm watching it. So he does want to watch it and he wants to see Baby Yoda. And it's like, oh, okay, well, well we can kind of see, you know, we'll see. You know, um, I would have to watch all the episodes first. And then, you know, if um, I know there's a part that, okay, we need to skip. Okay, that's fine. We need to skip because it's really doesn't anything. It's not, I don't know, it's not that he's seen before. Like, he's seen, like, you know, um, a, a, you know, a blaster, or a blaster, you know, gun battle. Like, he's seen that before, but, uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I might let him watch it. We'll see. <laughs> Jury's still out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I might let him just see Baby Yoda, and that's, you know, a scene where I know, okay, where Baby Yoda is in, and just let him see Baby Yoda. We'll see. It's so hard because I know he loves Star Wars and yeah. So anyways, um, <laughs> before I get like way too off track here. <laughs> um, yep. Yeah, so really enjoying it. This is the way, you know, I'm just going to keep saying that. Yeah. <laughs> um, I've been looking for a Baby Yoda mug and I, that's on my list. I have quite a few mugs on my wish list that I want and Oh, so hard to find. A Baby Yoda one is one of those. I haven't found one I liked. I've seen some at Marshalls or Winners, but I didn't like them. So, yeah, I'm going to check Amazon. Yeah, because there's that mug I'm looking for. I'm looking for um, a Bell mug, which is very stinking hard. Um, yeah. I'm not sure. That there's a few other ones I can't think of right now. But, yeah, it's just like, why are they so hard to find? I know, and if I, if I go to Marshalls or Winners, um, it is hard to find Disney mugs that, because sometimes they're picked over and people get it before I do, so, yeah. <laughs> mm. So, let's, um, drink our delicious cup of coffee. Uh, welcome back to my channel, um, so Coffee with Stephanie. I'm Stephanie. I'm happy that you're, you are here with me and clicked on this video. And welcome if you are my regular subscribers and friends. I'm so happy you guys are here with me. It's honestly the best part of my day, just having a coffee chat with you guys. And if you are not subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. I'll be happy to have you. Welcome you to my YouTube family. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm drinking out Chip and Dale. Okay, my... Probably, probably, like, probably my favorite mug. And this is my second Chip and Dale mug. I had another one and I broke. I know it's devastating. And no, I am not over it. Okay, I love that mug. I still love it. And, um, I really don't know if I, I would ever find that mug again. Um, but it was kind of like this one, you know, where it's double-sided. Um, this one I found on eBay. The one that broke was on Etsy. So, I don't know. I, I do keep looking for it. You know, once in a while I'll check Etsy or eBay. 
um because i would would yeah by some kind of miracle i would love to find it again because it was my absolutely favorite but unfortunately it broke and yo i'm not over it okay <laughs> no i love my mugs i love collecting them and oh i need more room yeah i already i already, I already know how to make more room yeah so get rid of the plates <laughs> We don't need plates. <laughs> no. no. I'm actually going to make room um, up, up here for more mugs. Yeah. Eventually. Yeah. Um, but yeah. Anyway, so like my Chip and Dale mug came from eBay. And I love Chip and Dale. Chip and Dale. They are my favorite characters. Um, right up next. Right next to Mickey and Minnie. Absolutely love them. Adore them. Um, grew up watching Chip and Dale like a lot of you guys probably did. And always loved seeing the trouble they got got into with, you know, Donald Duck or um, Pluto, right? So, or Mickey. Um, so you might know where I'm going with this. There's a reason I chose Chip and Dale for this morning's coffee chat. Because yesterday I realized that Disney Plus, um, this, this year in May, on the most wonderful time of the year, no, no, not Christmas. No, my birthday, my birthday, <laughs> national holiday. Uh, they are releasing on Disney Plus. And it's not a remake. They say it's a comeback. Um, Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers, a movie. Okay. Now, of course, at first it's like, you know, kind of, it's kind of mixed emotions. Okay. Um, yay. Mm. You know. Um, excited, but also nervous because it's like, don't screw it up. Don't butcher it. You know, um, and I read the comments and a lot of people said the voices, the actors that do the voices for Chip and Dale, that they couldn't get over the voices. And I was like, oh, oh no, 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 no. Yeah. <laughs> you know, um, so I saw a clip on TikTok, of course, tickety talk. And, you know, I will watch it. Um, I won't judge it until I watch the whole thing. But the voices, the voices, those aren't Chip and Dale's voices. They're not even close to it. So, yeah, I, 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 I don't, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Like, the jury is out for me right now. Um, yeah, like it looks good, but when you hear Chip and Dale talk, it's like, oh, that's not how they sound, you know? Uh, I know. And it's just like when I'm, um, they, I, I found out they. Are, they were doing Fraggle Rock, and I grew up watching Fraggle Rock. Fraggle Rock Muppets, you know, I was there, and I have Fraggle Rock, the first two seasons on DVD. I love Fraggle Rock, and uh, I think it's on Discovery Plus, and um, they redid that one. I haven't watched it yet. I have it. I have it, you know, saved on the fire stick. Kind of nervous to watch it, to tell you the truth. So, like... It's just because it's a classic. Don't screw it up, you know. So, anyways, but yeah, Chip and Dale movie coming out. Oh yeah. Excited, but also nervous. Yes. <laughs> and it does look good from what I saw, but yeah. Oh. Yeah. We'll see. All right. So I'm gonna drink the rest of my coffee and um go watch a little bit of Everybody Loves Raymond and go watch. Mandalorian, of course. Well then, and um, yeah, I'll check back in. I'm not sure what I'm doing today. Um, hoping to get upstairs to finish the touch ups in our room so I can finish putting our room together, and it'll probably be another couple, two, three weeks. <laughs> I'm hoping by the end of like next month I'll be up, be able to. Yeah, it just depends how much I can get done, how often I can get up there by myself and get everything done. Um, so. And I have to take off the green paint, and sometimes that could be a pain in the, you know, wet booty. Because uh, last time I would take it off, it not tear off in one piece. It ripped in pieces, and it's like, um, yeah, it took me a little bit longer. So, yeah, we'll see. Uh, but first, coffee. Nothing happens before coffee, right? Exactly. So I made my way upstairs to start the touch-ups, but honestly, I don't think I'm going to do that today because I'm kind of, I'm ticked. Um... I think I'm going to just take off the green tape. I've started taking some off um, right here 
and it came off pretty good so hopefully the rest of the tape comes off i have to get a chair and get up here because i'm not that tall but the reason why i'm ticked is because you can probably see behind me our closet organizers that we bought last year well that i bought last year on amazon fell now the hubbies has been acting up i've even tried to glue them together but they still fall piece of crap uh, that's how mad i am okay piece of crap um yeah so i have to figure out what to do um at the time i bought these these were like the only options this was well the only option on amazon because like we have slanted ceilings in our bedroom therefore we have slanted ceiling in our closet part of it is slanted so it really makes it hard to to look for a closet organizer and when we moved in there were on this this side there were shelves that's it just um your brackets um these things right there and the shelves and on here there was like i think one shelf and i think there was a rod but the rod eventually broke and then it just was a shelf and then i remember i think henry was just a baby and i was up here folding clothes and i was putting clothes and i tripped and i grabbed onto the clothes that were hanging and that took care of the shelf like it was the, the shelf was still hanging but barely by thread um yeah because I used it to grab to support myself um so that's why you know because it's just very hard like well I don't know what else to do um because we have clothes that you know need to be hung and clothes that don't need to be hung like pants and that and jammies um so exhibit a this is how it broke nice oh can see you get Oh, can't even see it. There, uh, there we go. Nice big there. There we go. That's a better shot. It's kind of awkward because it's like I got two. <laughs> that's that's an awkward piece. Um, exhibit A. Nice big plumber crack right there. So, um, and if you look at, it, look at this. I think that's beyond repair. So, <laughs> I don't think duct tape can't fix that and duct tape fixes everything according to red green <laughs> so <laughs> yeah so i'm checked <laughs> um yeah so that just put me in a whole different mood and not a happy mood at all so i'm just going to take off tape and really i don't even want to do that i don't want to do that it's like you know i feel defeated i'm like yeah no i'm done um because now i have to figure something out because now our room is going to look absolutely messy because of that because we have clothes on the floor um yeah and um there are i did look i took a quick look and there are other options um for closet organizers and they're steel rods they're steel rods but the connectors are plastic now now mind you it does say in the description that the plastic is strengthened plastic i'm sorry what strengthened plastic uh, what does that mean that it's super super strong plastic because it better be like i'm tired of this cheap plastic all right hubby came up here he is trying to make some donut dough for the air fryer um yeah <laughs> that he's filming it for his youtube channel so anyways i was kind of helping him with that before i came up here um to do this but now it's like yeah no here's my white flag i'm done um i like since we have santa ceilings we can't have dressers in here because there's no room now the boys do have dressers okay and they are outside of their bedroom in the hallway and the only reason why they're in the hallway was because there was no room in their bedroom with beds but now that they have bunk beds and there's plenty of room that i could possibly you know if it didn't look too crowded move the dressers in there or maybe one dresser you know so that's that's also an option now and then maybe we could look for we would need two dressers one for each of us 
yeah i don't know i'm just trying to think and right now i have nothing um nothing concrete just ideas um possibilities we'll see i don't know because there's there's no way to fit a dresser even if it was like a short one i don't know yeah i don't know possibly like maybe like um because i have like our organizer here because we don't since we don't have a dresser to put our socks and you know delicates in you know what i mean um they're in here in like storage um baskets right so and i have his sweaters folded into the other cubby holes um like right here right so i don't have to hang that up i have my pants here so that's good it's just like the stuff that we can't hang up are like pajama stuff and like he has t-shirts and um jogging pants you know you know so i was like i need something somewhere for that stuff to go out uh, to, i mean to go somewhere so yeah i don't know hmm. oh was that magic wand <laughs> yeah so anyways over and out for now all right so the boys are gonna be home soon the whole day just sipped on by zippity duda um it just doesn't seem possible and i just i haven't done much like i really haven't and i'm still ticked about well besides laundry and housework you know <laughs> that's every day <laughs> but like i'm still ticked about our closet you know and figuring that out and i did take off all the green tape and most of it came off pretty good and didn't give me any trouble i just have to get the little section above our door but i need a chair for that so i can reach it but that's it and if like grabbing a chair to do that so yeah so um, you know I, I, at least i did something in our room um even though i did not get to the touch-ups and i just wasn't in the mood for the touch-ups i'm like let's do it another day uh but anyways i had lunch and i watched a couple more episodes of everybody loves raymond and i did watch the mandalorian this morning so yeah <laughs> you know I, I love the mandalorian but i do not love how there's only eight episodes in a season like come on give me at least 13 episodes okay like why is that is this just a joy was crazy probably um <laughs> but so like i was i was having lunch and i was watching after i watched Harry Potter's raymond i decided okay i'm gonna check out the new fraggle rock um i still have to finish the episode but my mom um stopped by quick she knocked at the door as she dropped off the boys valentine day treats um she couldn't get to the store because their their um driveway is like an ice rink it is ice all over it's terrible and we're supposed to get more freezing rain tonight so there's a storm coming tonight so i'm not looking forward to it there might not be any school tomorrow i don't know we'll see and if if so oh boy i don't know what i'm gonna do put billies in my coffee because if there's no school tomorrow that means a five-day weekend because friday's a pa day so that's no no school um and that's a day for the teachers i guess they work a pa day is a day for the teachers um to work on class assignments future assignments stuff like that um and then monday is family day so it's a holiday um so yeah <laughs> like oh uh, so yeah well i don't know you know you know you know it's just not going to you know like <laughs> if i do stay home you know um yeah five days just seems like a long i know that's a long weekend <laughs> but um yeah so anyways fraggle rock i actually like it um the characters, there's only one character that they change a little bit, looks a little bit different, um, and that's Moki, but it's not too big of a dramatic change, you know, you can still tell, okay, that's Smokey. she just looks a little bit different, like, um, her hair is pulled back in a ponytail, that's, that's it, you know, um, so, that was really it, and the voices, they're not exactly the same, so, like, I, I don't think they are, um, and I don't... I, I don't like say I don't know if um the people who originally did the voices are doing the voices because they don't really sound like the original voices I would have to check um but they sound close to it like they sound pretty darn close they sound like okay so it's like not that big of a change but see when you if you watch a Chippendale trailer for the movie okay um and they talk 
and you'll notice a difference. So, you know, that's the only thing throwing me off of the movie, you know, because Chip and Dale have a voice, a, a um, distinctive, you know, voice that as soon as they talk, you know who they are, right? And it's like, it's just like an actor using his everyday voice. Like, they didn't even try to sound like Chip and Dale. So that's why that's throwing me off. So it's like, really, like, you, like you couldn't find somebody who could do, you know? Because there's a lot of impersonators who would, you know, sound really good. But, ugh, I don't know. We'll see. When it comes out, we'll see. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, but, yeah, so far, Fraggle Rock, I'm liking it. I just watched half episode because... Um, my mom stopped by quick, so and the boys gonna be home soon. But yeah, so far I'm happy with it. That's good because um, you know, don't go messing with something that ain't broken, right? That's right. <laughs> and before I forget, the hubby still um is a monster now. <laughs> uh, yes, he is trying new recipes with the air fryer, having fun with it, and. This was next on his list, um, donuts. So, we'll see if it works. Um, he does have his own YouTube channel. He's had it for a while, and he's just starting to post again on it. Um, I think he always posts it, video games like Fortnite and that kind of stuff. So, yeah, he's just starting to post different stuff. And, yeah. All right. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my peace and quiet. That's right. Ah, yeah, okay, so this might be the last time I get peace and quiet till Tuesday. So, depending on how tomorrow goes, so I'm going, I'm going to enjoy it. Got some donuts. Waiting for the air fryer. Oh, nice. Oh, so I've already had one and Casey had one and it has Henry had one? I don't think so. No, he did. Oh, he did? Okay. And um, he just we just dip it in melted butter and put some cinnamon sugar mixture. I have it from the Dollar Tree and sprinkle it on and it tastes really good. All right, hot from the air fryer and I mean hot. <laughs> Mm. And it's good. Hey, I'm, I'm good. Good. Mom, babe. I tell it all I can show you. It's good. Okay. You got proof? Mm-hmm. Me too. Mm-hmm. You're not bad for a first attempt. Mm-hmm. And for air fryer. Who knew? You want a bite? I got milk with it. No, you got Okay. You got milk with it? Good choice. Mm. We're just having dessert before dinner. <laughs> just that kind of day, okay? <laughs> Alright, so I think I'm just going to say goodnight. I have sugary lips. <laughs> Cinnamon sugary lips. Mmm, yum. Uh, just end the vlog so I can just put it together and kind of just take it easy tonight. Relax, help the boys with their homework. That ain't relaxing. <laughs> uh, and we have math homework, so I'll have to see how much he has to do. And uh, Casey just has to go over his sight words. And yeah, that's it. So I'm just going to say goodnight and I'll see you guys in the next fun video. I'm still thinking about closet options, um, ideas, trying to think of something different. Um, the ideal closet organizer that we need is, is something that goes on the back just on the back wall and those are expensive on Amazon yeah they're rubber made mm -hmm. the cheapest one I found was like 170 something <laughs> yeah 170 and it's Hello. like we want to make <laughs> yeah <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! Yeah, you want to see Baby Yoda? You want to get both very excited to see Baby Yoda? <laughs> so, I'm let him watch a little bit of it. <laughs> Nobody wants to see that. But, alright. <laughs> Anyways, to the loo. I'll see you guys in the next fun video. We'll see what tomorrow is like. Um, weather. Seafood, apparently. <laughs>
my favorite uh, I always remember that clip from my girl. Um, she like, it was, I don't forget. I forget what it was but, what exactly. But my penguin. She, she asked, "So, oh, do you like seafood?" The my penguin the girl. Yes, yeah, so your penguin is so cute. No, and uh, the the Jamie Lee Curtis, no, you know, bookie. said yes. And no, she man. was chewing food, and she opened her mouth. See food. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Squishy. Oh, squishy. I thought you said cute. Squishy, yes. Well, she's cute and squishy, just like you. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll see ya. See ya next fun video. Take care, everybody. Thanks for tagging along with me and joining me today. And bye. <laughs> bye for kids. <laughs> oh yes, this is my circus. These are my monkeys. <laughs> yeah. All right. Bye.